Yo, ho, ho, what's up, guys? The Insane Game Freak here. And this is kind of a quick video, uh, kind of outlining some stuff and possible Bakuman licensing hype video. It's like a pre hype video. So, for those who don't know, I was on Viz Anime site primarily because um, One Punch Man got licensed by Viz, the manga and the anime. And usually, when those, when they both get licensed, that probably means it's not going to be on Crunchyroll, so I had two choices, Daisuke or Viz. And I said, well, fuck it, I'll go on Viz. Well, I go on Viz, and I look, and I notice, huh, the Bakuman anime is on Viz's site. And I'm talking about the manga. We, I've been known they had the license of the manga. I mean, like, the first two seasons of the anime are on Viz's site. Now, for those who don't know... Bakuman's anime originally was picked up by Media Blasters back like in 2010, 2011 or some shit, but they only had a chance to release like one DVD with the first seven episodes on it, and I think it was around 2012 when they came out and said, we've lost the license to Bakuman, but they made it reference that somebody had picked it up. Now, most people thought it would either be Viz or like Sentai, but we didn't hear anything any time soon after that. And it seems like recently they've decided to throw Bakuman on Viz Anime site. Which pretty much leads me to believe that the license that they originally had, and people are like, but, but Bakuman has three seasons, why are only the first 50 episodes on there? Well, the original license Mania Blasters had was during, I think, when the second season was airing. So technically, it has probably, I'm pretty sure it has the same license as the original, as Mania Blasters did. That's why it's only the first two seasons, because the third season wasn't out or even known to be a thing at the time i think at the time of that original license season two was still airing when they got the license to it but and and also people got to realize this doesn't necessarily mean that they have the dvd release dvd or blu-ray release it implies that that be a strong possibility but for right now i know they have the streaming rights at least because it's on visit site before the episode starts, you even get the Viz Media logo thing, and it's on Hulu. And I'm like, well, that's a good sign that Bakuman, at, at the very least, will be able to be legally streamed. If anyone didn't know, when Media Blasters had the license for Bakuman, you still had to watch it illegally if you wanted to watch it because there was no other way to watch it. Media Blasters doesn't have like a streaming service like Sentai or Funimation or Viz does, or Crunchyroll. Um... So you were still kind of shit creek. So the fact that this is showing up and being used on Hulu, because it's they're using the Hulu player, which just tells me it's on Hulu. That that tells me one, Bakuman license is probably confirmed to be Viz who's licensed it. Two, they got the streaming rights, but the the problem now is we don't know if they have if they're gonna get season three, we don't know if they're gonna dub it, and we don't know if there's gonna be a release. The one thing about Viz that always kind of sucks is that for whatever reason, Viz never really tells anybody shit. Like, for example, remember when Neon Alley first came out? I didn't know they had the rights to K. I didn't know they had the rights to Excel World. Side note, Excel World apparently is getting a sequel, and K, I already know, sequel has just started airing, I believe. We don't, Viz doesn't, like, openly talk about it half the time. And then the last time they talked about a show they got was, like, Tiger and Bunny the Rising... Blood Lad and like Gargantua, I forget the whole name, but it's like Gargantua something. Those were like the last shows I remember them mentioning that they had the like the rights to. Versus this other shit that just seems to be the shit that kind of flows in the dark. And then it just pops up when you least expect it. So this video is kind of a soft confirmation that Viz owns the rights to the Bakuman anime. The problem is we don't know if that means season three license stuff or physical release but you can right now go look at the first two seasons legally now you now have a legal venue to watch bakuman for those who hadn't tried it bakuman is legit as fuck i was hoping for a physical release we just didn't hear anything about it and technically we still haven't heard anything about it but knowing that it's on the site because i was looking i was watching one punch man because one punch man streaming so the fact that it's already on the site is good news just really wish Viz would talk about this stuff a little bit more openly because it's so jarring when you just see shit and it like gives you the idea that everything's in limbo. And granted, just because they have the, the streaming rights doesn't mean they have the physical rights. Uh, 
why do you think Hitman Reborn has been on Vista's site for how long? And we still don't have a physical release for that? <laughs> Hell, we don't have a goddamn dub announcement for that. Which probably means we're not going to get it. But still, I'm just, I'm just trying to make a point. So, Bakuman. Licensing is going forward. And we got the first two seasons available to stream. Let's see. So, throwing out that Bakuman support again would be kind of nice, guys. I'm, I'm happy, but, you know... We don't really know much, and I want to get the ball rolling. I want that. I want that. I want that hype train. I want that fucking hype train. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Ah! All right, I'm gonna stop. But uh, please leave your thoughts and comments in the comment section below. I figured I'd go ahead and uh, put this out here. And any thoughts or things you hear, because I, I like to have an open forum about this stuff. I didn't see anyone make a video about this or even any forum post about it. So here it is. Discuss, converse, share, comment, Facebook. Twitter, Patreon in the comment description below. Thanks for watching. And uh, like I used to say in my Bakuman reviews, keep on drawing.